Hey, how's everyone doing today? Tall Dan here. So I woke up today and really thought I lost my mind because right now I'm on my way to New York to pick up another trailer. I really can't say no to a great deal on a trailer and I have the most trailers out of anyone I know. I thought I had five trailers before but I recount it and I don't know how I thought I had five but right now I'm going to get the fifth trailer. And so I was talking to somebody on Facebook. Well, I looked on Facebook Marketplace, found the trailer I liked, sent the guy a message about it to ask how much it was. He sent me back a price, which I was already like ready to go get it because it was a price I couldn't beat. So I asked him for the address. He sent me back the address, which is in New York. And I looked it up, it's three and a half hours away. So I'm like, all right, I think I can talk myself into that one. But for shits and giggles, I sent them a message. I'm like, hey, you're three and a half hours away. Can you do any better on the price? So he sends me back a message two minutes later, cuts $500 off the price. I'm like, all right, done deal. I'm on my way. So now I've been on the road for about an hour now. I still haven't got my GoPro in the mail yet, so I can't make like longer videos, so I have to cut this one short. But now I'm on my way to New York to pick up another trailer. All my friends know I'm the guy to come with when you need help moving something or cleaning out a storage unit or anything like that. Because I'm the guy who has all the different size trailers and is not afraid to work. I'll do anything to make a buck. I'll jump in the dumpster, go trash picking. I don't really care. I like to live life. I like to gamble. I like to drink socially, but this is me. I'm a trailer guy. <laughs> I figure it's cheaper than getting a box truck, paying all the insurance on it, but pretty soon I'm probably going to get another enclosed trailer also. And when I decided to go get the trailer, I went downstairs, woke up my wife just to let her know. Her reaction was priceless. I wish I got it on camera. She's like, you're kidding. Dan, you're kidding. No, you're kidding. I'm like, no, I'm about to head to New York. Uh, I could probably pick it up this afternoon because you wanted to do scrap today. And she's like, why are you getting another trailer? We have no room. Where are you going to put it? I'm like, I'll sell one of my other ones. So I convinced her if I put one up for sale, I can go get this one. <laughs> oh, she agreed to it because she loves me so much. And I love her so much also. But I'll tell you guys a little about, ah, a little bit about my trailers. So the one I'm going to get now is a 16 foot unenclosed, but it has bigger sidewalls to it. So I can do more scrap, well I can load more scrap onto it, do a lot more with it. I have another 16 foot unenclosed trailer, which has littler sidewalls, so can't st stack stuff too high, have to use a bunch of straps and everything. I have a 20 foot camper trailer which I gutted the inside out of to make it into storage. I have another 20 foot enclosed trailer which I use to clean out lockers and everything or help somebody when they need to be moved out their house or clean out a storage unit. I have a 16 foot enclosed trailer also which you guys see at the market all the time, blue and white. But I hope you guys like my videos. If you haven't already, please subscribe. And if there's anything I can do better, please don't hesitate to send me a message. I'm still new to YouTube, so I'm trying my best. So I hope you guys like all my videos. I'll talk to you later. Peace.